Hello, I'm Kale Roberts and I'm an assistant editor here at Mother Earth News. Today I'm going to show you how to see if your seeds that you've saved are still viable to use in your garden this year. If you're like me, as winter draws to a close, you get very excited about ordering new seeds. So you start pulling out your seed catalogs, but you also maybe have, like me, a very disorganized seed box of all the seed packets you've ordered in the past that you've been saving. I need to make sure that the seeds that are in here, some of them dating back to 2009, are still viable to use in my garden this year. I've got a very simple and easy test that you can perform at home to make sure that your seeds are still viable and you can know the percentage of seeds that are likely to germinate. What you're going to need are Ziploc bags, either paper towels that we're going to moisten so I have some water here, or you can use coffee filters. I'm going to use these coffee filters because they're very easy to fold over. You want to moisten your paper towel or your coffee filter lightly, enough to get it pretty damp. We don't want our seeds to be thirsty during this time. So lay your coffee filter or your paper towel out flat, and you want to count out either 10 or 20 seeds to check. The reason that you pick 10 or 20 is because it easily correlates to a 100%. So you know that if eight of your 10 seeds end up sprouting, then you have about 80% viability, which is really good. So I've done 20 here. If you have fewer seeds left over, you probably want to shoot for just using 10. So I'm going to fold over my corners of the coffee filter until all of the seeds are covered, but they're not touching each other, like that. And I take one of my Ziploc bags, and I'm going to put this moistened and seed-filled coffee filter inside and zip it up most of the way, but we want it to be able to breathe a little bit, so don't zip it up all the way. So that's pretty much it. I'm just going to leave these in my house somewhere at room temperature, so between 65 and 80 degrees, for about a week's time. You can also check the back of your seed packet, and it will tell you exactly the number of days that it generally takes that seed to germinate. But I found that 7 to 10 days is plenty of time to know for sure. Repeat this seed germination test for all your seed packets that you've had saved, and you'll set yourself up to save big when it comes time to order seeds for this year's garden. And for more great gardening tips, check out MotherEarthNews.com or pick up a copy of our magazine.